Hey everyone, I'm Lou and you're watching Live Free and DIY. In my last project video I made this clothing rack. It's got these two shelves so I can put shoes or whatever on there and a pretty large shelf on top so I can put other stuff that I don't usually need to get to very quickly. Um, and of course there is a base on the bottom that will allow me to put more stuff on there. But mainly the thing is to hang my clothes. And this is gonna be replacing a chest of drawers that I have. It's a really old chest of drawers and I think it'd be better just to have things hanging. The reason for that is, I don't know if it happens to everybody else, but it seems like my clothes that stay in my drawers for a long period of time start to have that old person smell on them and then I end up having to wash them and I think if I just hang them they'll just always be kind of airing out all the time so I won't have to deal with that. Plus I really like the new modern sort of industrial look of this. I haven't actually installed this in the house yet because there's two problems that need to be fixed with it that I didn't deal with in the video and I want to talk about them now and I'll probably make a video about it maybe next time. But the first problem is that this bar is not actually level. There's a slight angle and what I need to do is I need to raise up those three bars uh, probably about a half an inch. So I'm probably just going to take some wood, cut them to size and make them decorative, put some more uh, stain on them and use those as a base for the... Um, use those as a base for the pipe. The other thing is that it rocks a little bit. There was a couple high spots that I apparently didn't get level and I just need to level them off. So what I want to do is on the opposite sides of the base there are casters and I will lower them until it is perfectly even. Just a little bit so I'll just use some really thin wood kind of to shimmy it down a little bit. I'm thinking that next week's project video is just going to be about me fixing those two issues. There's a couple other project videos that I really want to get to. Um, I really want to do the squatty potty. I really need to fix my tripod, which I'm holding right now and is broken. And I really like to do something for the lighting, in, especially when it's dark. So I'd like to build some actual ph photography style lights. As many of you know who follow me on Instagram, my father-in-law passed last week and that's why I wasn't able to get the project video out as soon as I would like to have. So it went out this week. So sorry about that, but I'm sure you all understand. Uh, Friday I did post a video announcing the winner of the YouTube play button so that went really well and I'm going to start a new giveaway today. The thing I'm giving away is this survival bracelet that I made in a couple project videos ago. This is 550 paracord. It's about 10 feet and it's the quick release paracord bracelet. So basically you just push out these two little nubbies give it a good yank and you got about 10 feet of paracord that you can use in a survival situation. So I'm gonna give this sucker away. It fits on me pretty snugly. That's how I like I, to have my paracord bracelets. Um, it's about eight inches. I will measure my wrist and put it in the description below. But I figure if you win it and it doesn't fit you, you can just give it away as, as a gift to somebody. So the details on how to win this are in the description below and I'll put a box somewhere here that you can click on to go to my website and subscribe. Also, I got a haircut. What do you think? Um, trying to go back to what I had a few months ago. I actually went to a barber for this and obviously it's not as long as it was back then so I'm still growing that out. I, I like it. I think it'll look good once the top starts to grow out. So what I've been watching and listening to, not really much this past week because I've just been super busy with family stuff. But I did notice on Netflix the next season of Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. is out. I just started watching that. I think I'm on episode 2 or 3. It's doing okay. 
Uh, 12 Monkeys skipped July 4th for the holiday, so that was kind of a bust. So I'm kind of waiting for this finale. I think there's maybe one or two more episodes left. It's still really awesome. But uh, there is a new podcast out called Making Geeks. It's pretty interesting. I think they just put out their third episode. It's pretty awesome. I'll put a link to that in the description below. Check it out. It's something that's good to, you know, sit back, relax, and listen to. Nothing too deep, nothing too crazy. Oh, yeah. David Welder has been doing a 30-day vlogging challenge, which is pretty cool. But last week, he put out a cool little DIY cabinet scraper that he made. And it's something that I never thought of doing myself. But I thought it was really cool, so I'm going to put a link to that in the description below as well. I think that's about it for this vlog. I hope you all have a really great weekend. Thanks again, everybody who has liked and subscribed. And if you have any questions, please leave a comment below. I really appreciate you guys. You're totally awesome. I will catch you next week with another project. Until then, get out there and make something. Bye. Buggers! <laughs> Buggers! You know you're gonna be in my in my video, right? I'm not gonna be in your video. That's saying boogers. I'll say something worse then. Say it worse. Then you won't be able to put me in your video. I can edit like a mofo. Also, I started reading the book boogers. Seven Eves. <laughs> <laughs>